Those vendor meetings get brutal. This crew was going to need a Christmas miracle pretty soon. And so, you need to license the analysis engine, but also need the security add-on for the licenses. If you want to actually analyze your security, we have new licenses coming out in Q2 for that, but you don't want to wait for the Blim module or the noise pod infiltration engine. Those also have licenses into the northbound API for IAT-centric BGP environments. We also just renamed the Blim module, because nobody bought that shit when it was called the Bipize Engineator. Just kick me in the groin, would you? While this blowhard vendor babbles on, let's see what those in the room are actually thinking. Man, if I won the lottery I could get away from ass bags like this. You can keep your freaking blim module. Will this guy ever shut up? Like ever? I gotta take a dump so bad. If I ever made a remake of the Dukes of Hazard, I would name the sheriff like Roscopy Code Train. I can't even hear what he is saying anymore. I gotta go to the crapper. I might injure myself here. It's not because we want to gouge you, per se. But this sort of crazy ass fee structure lets me do enough peyote to promise you some sort of access to innovation, and keep a straight face as I do. Shall we dig into the guest portal portal with Myrtle in a girdle now? Laying it on thick, he is. Meanwhile, let's see what the others are thinking while the vendor blathers on. Man, I could really jump back in high school. I wonder if my mom kept my guitar. Maybe it ended up in the garage with all my other old shit. I'll call her after this goddamn meeting. Once I walked along the side of a pond as a suburban park. There were squirrels scurrying about, and children playing. As I looked into the water, it dawned on me that I had never really committed a crime. Like a serious crime. Don't ask why, but I suddenly felt like I should. I walked into the village, and found a laundromat. Seeing several unattended washing machines, I started mixing clothes from different machines. I never felt so alive. This guy is still talking. Now with every 25 pack of heavy licenses, we take away two planet cards and credit you a bonus packet sword. But the packet sword requires a security module pickle tickle which can only be renewed by a Gemini when the firewall is in the dingleweed sector. Ah. I'm in my happy place. It's just glorious. That vendor shithead can't hurt me here. I hope Santa Claus shows up. Marty. How you doing brother? Hi Santa. This meeting is brutal. I can't take much more of this vendor dickhead. Oh, let me guess. You want good old Santa to maybe kick his ass? Maybe do a black bag job on him? Whoa. That would be so awesome. Can you, would you do that for me? Ho ho ho. Fat Santa needs to keep his skills sharp. And this guy is just terrible. It would be my honor. Maybe bitch slap him so hard that his mother feels it, back in whatever kennel she's in. Finally. Maybe Santa can save the day. So that covers the first third of the required licensing and obligatory complexity of our solution. Are there any questions? I think you're just about done here, Vince. Santa? Why are you here? I have a few presents for you, Vince. Like this. Oh wait, that came as a set of two. Now let's round out your price pack with a little something special. Let's apply a booster license on that, shall we? Now say hello to my little friend. Okay, 
I'll go now. I'm going. Oh, that was too good, Santa. I also hate vendor meetings. But... Was it... Real, Santa? Is that windbag really gone? Or am I just daydreaming? Marty had a point there. Was this just a dream? Was he really still trapped in meeting hell? Come on, Marty. It's real if you believe it's real. Trust the fat bastard in the ugly suit. I want to believe. Because I don't want to go back to that freaking meeting. Then don't, Marty. Let's do some peyote and talk about cars and shit. Merry Christmas. Fucking A. Merry Christmas, Santa. All's well that ends well. The end.